Hey, Pearsall members. Thanks so much for being here today. The tarot card draw for the month of April is the Three of Wands. I'm going to show it to you right here, just if you take a look at it. And then I'm going to just set it over here so I can talk about it with you. Um, okay, so the Three of Wands is a really great card to have because it really indicates to us that we've done a good job, that we worked hard and that we accomplished many things, and we did that based on our skill and our hard work. The red robe worn by the character in the card means that you worked really hard for everything in your life, and that you have mastered your skills, and that you've put a lot of motivation and work to achieve the things that you have achieved, and so therefore you're successful. And this card also tells us that you have a right to feel proud of yourself and feel proud of your accomplishments and the effort and motivation that you put in to everything that you have in your life. And it didn't come easy. And you had to give up a lot to achieve these things and to get where you are today. So maybe a lot of your friends were, I don't know, off at parties and doing really fun things and you were home and studying and not really um, participating and things that would distract you or take you away from your goals or your mission. So the Three of Wands is really affirming that you have been humble in your accomplishments and that you made it and that you did it on your own and you did it well. This card also shows us, because the character in the card has his back to us, that you haven't really looked to the outside world to glorify you, that your life fulfillment is based on what you put into it and not what others put into it. You're not like waiting around for somebody to do it for you. You've done it on your own. You've, you've put the work in, you've accomplished the thing. So it's awesome. And it's okay to shine and it's okay to take a bow. You're pretty good at checking your ego, but if you're not, keep that in mind, being proud of yourself for, um, really putting in a lot of work that's important. That's important for you to feel that. It's it's a nice thing to feel. Just don't let your pride be over other people. So keep your ego in check. That's also a message from the Three of Wands. If you'll notice in the card, the Three of Wands has those staffs that are really steadily planted in the ground. And that's a representation of someone who has mastered the skills that they have set out to master. So um, because you have mastered skills, you might be ready to start out on a new journey. So what will you accomplish now? Because you have the whole world in front of you. You're looking forward to the next project or to the next um, career or the next house or the next relationship. <laughs> so everything that you've done up until this point really serves as building blocks for your next achievement. So you make these accomplishments and these strides, and then when you put them all together, they bring you to your next point in the journey. So if you've been thinking that some things are about ready to change or you can feel that change is coming, that might be why. Um, so thanks for sharing some of your time with me today, and I wish each and every one of you blessed abundance and way to go for the three of wands. Have a great day.